Hi guys, if you're watching this in the future and not currently, we're on lockdown right now. We're in isolation and we haven't been now for a week. I've been really enjoying myself with the kids. Um, um, got less of around the house, but it's come to the stage now where I can do a video. I'm trying to do all the bits and bobs, but it's so difficult doing electrical YouTube videos and I can't do any electrics. But anyway, I'm lucky enough that Velocity Pro Gear has sent me their van bag. This is the uh, Rogue 1.5 van bag. Uh, sick bit of kit, PB Plumber did a video on it, which made me want it even more. Uh, I'm sick to death for carrying around my iPad, my GoPro stuff, my gimbal, uh, drinks, notepad, all the other stuff that goes with it. So I'll take this in the van, give you a run through with it. Um, all the, well, the pros, barely any cons to be honest, I can't think of, but I'll do an honest review. So thank you Velocity for sending me this. It's Awesome, I love it already, even though I can't really use it. But what I'm doing with this is, I'm using this, obviously you can personalize it, and I'll show you inside in a minute. Um, you can take sections out, you can replace it. So I use it almost for a gadget slash work bag. Other people would then use it for a lunch bag, a bag. You can use so many different aspects that you can use it for. Um, but the problem is we're on lockdown and I'm not really allowed outside, so it's to be sneaky, sneaky. See you in there. Now I'm safe. Hope you've got me in shot. Van bag. Um, I'll go through a few things that it came with. So to start with, if you look up here, it came with a head seat attachment. So when you unzip, unzip this, this will clip this, this will keep it in place. A few things I already like about the van. It's rigid, it's got big thick zips, it's got nice Velcro, a little bit of leather on top. Um, you've got this little detachable bag. I think you can get personalized, don't quote me, personalized stuff stick on that. So like my logo with NB or something. Um, it's hardware, it's durable. I've already had my kids standing on it when I wasn't looking because it was on the floor with my gadgets in it. So first thing at the back on the top, that was loud, on the top. So in here, there's a massive pouch, big enough for especially electricians or the trades, keep your laptop. So I've got the Mac, that's a 13 inch screen, I think. So that fits nicely in there. 15 inch would fit in, definitely. Uh, if I go and unzip the bag itself. I'll lift that up. So this is the attachment, the little clip that you get. And that hooks on there. So that will stop the bag from folding and falling. Right, so now that's secured. We've got that, pull this out of the way. So in the top here, we've got a Velcro and another pouch for a notepad. Uh, this will also fit in, which I found, so that's my notepad, A4 size, but it's obviously bigger than A4 because you've got the di diameters for the notepad to fit inside. So this is my iPad Pro, so this is 13 inch screen, which also fits nice and neatly in there, and also the iPad also fit in the front pouch. So all a bonus there. Uh, got a few bits for your pens. Next thing which I think is really cool, so this here is just a big flap, but this is a solid flap so you can either use this as a work platform in the sense of not for tools but for putting your sandwiches on it's designed for your notepad so you can write stuff on your notepad open this up so in the bottom compartment here you have velcroed in a cool bag which is handy for me because I tend to not bring lunch to work because I've got nowhere to keep it or I forget about it so in there you've got a cool bag um, we've got some couscous and vegetables Delicious yogurts. Um, obviously, you can put your drinks and everything in there. But you don't have to use it for a lunch bag. It's designed for a lunch bag because it's foil lined. But also, you can take that out and you've got another compartment. So, with these compartments that are on about, you can chop and change. Also, we've got your Velcroed out sections. So, you can take them out and keep this as one massive bag if you wanted to, which is cool. So, a few things that I've got in, I like I said, I'm using this as a gadget bag. So, a little Vera screwdriver spanner set. Um, Beat headphones, which you lot have seen. Um, stuff for my GoPro. A power bank for my phone and my iPad that comes in very handy. Uh, my gimbal, which also got stand. So that fits in nicely in there, a lot of space. Some batteries for my tester. And then the side here, we've got two little cargo net pouches. 
Uh, one of those has just got a lead in for a mini SD card to USB-C for my iPad. Um, I've seen a few other people, a few other videos, people keep keeping a few tools in there or like screwdriver set or you talk screwdriver set or the expensive small tools that you don't want to leave in the van overnight. If you do leave your van stuff in the van, you can take them out with this. So let me pop a few of these things back in. So you can see there's plenty of room. I mean, they're like the smallest thing in the world. And then the power bank, suction cup, gimbal, gimbal stand. That and pop back in. Also, you can take this out and wash it and wipe it through, which is a bonus. Uh, another cool thing, right? So here, we all know I like to drink these. You got drink holders, so you got three in. The cool thing about this is, I'm gonna say the cool thing about this a lot because it's a cool thing. So this tab is actually velcroed down. So if we open that up, you actually have a little spongy pad. So if you had a certain type of drink, I think if you had a, because obviously these are all different holes as well. So your monster would normally fit in there or a can of Coke or whatever. Um, but instead of that flapping around, you've actually got a brace to wedge it up the right shape. So you turn it that way for this way, this way for this way. That slots in, drinks, there you go. And then obviously different assorted sizes. Next thing, you've got removable departments again, so you can move it. I've got my GoPro in here, and there's one of the dividers that you can just Velcro in and out. Uh, this is all from what I can tell, I wouldn't say it's waterproof, but it's water resistant. So you can give it a good wipe through um, if they spill anything in there. Uh, I'm not sure you can quite pick up the material it is, but it's like lunchbox material, it's really nice. I'm gonna close that on there, Velcro that shut. So that keeps that secure. Close that down, put your notepad back in. So all in all inside, there's absolute shed ton of space. Uh, you can personalize it a lot, which is the best thing. Like you say, you can put tools in it, you can put food in it, you put drinks in it, you can use it for gadgets, you don't you know, use it for a van bag, use it for a car bag, use it for a lot of different stuff. It's rigid as well, which helps a lot. So if I close this up, so if I disconnect it here, you lift it up, pull it out. Bob's your uncle, if I need your arm. Goes it down. Right, I'll run through a few of the external features. So, massive thick zip, delicious. Awesome handle, nice thick rubber, easy to hold on to. You've also got another strap there, that's a flap, that you can tuck stuff under. Tuck it down on the back. You've got, your, obviously, your anti-slip. Uh, pads that go on the seat, obviously if you put it down on a flat surface outside. Uh, and it, oh, also, not to forget, the shoulder straps. So obviously you can detach this. Nice thick padded strap, hard wearing, ain't gonna be ripping. Nice D-rings on the side, nice and chunky. I like a lot of these bags, they're just, they're just put out there, it's nice and thick, it's durable, it's it's chunky, it's, it's mm, delicious. Anyway, um, yeah, so as it stands, I've obviously, I'm yet to try this out in the field. Me and Adam got to use it once or twice before we got locked down. Um, I'm only taking one bag in and one bag out, obviously, of my gear instead of three trips before, which it was. And it has saved me a lot of time. It looks good. I can put it straight into my office so the kids aren't getting into it. I need to get used to the hang of that. Um, next thing is, yeah, so round it all off. Uh, negative wise, you can say the size, but it's, it's the size it's meant to be. I think if they turn around and offered one half a size, then possibility for other people, but it's a great bag. It's great to sit in the middle. It's nice for a little armrest for Adam as well, because I've got one this side. Obviously they don't have one that side. Uh, it's just a useful thing to have. If you take a lot of stuff in and out of the van every night, uh, paperwork, iPads, computer, your phone, you know, batteries, spares that you keep in here that you normally wouldn't, it's worth every penny. It really is. Um, I'll put a, okay, they're here, they're here. I'll put a link in the description of the website below and you can go check it out.